I'm Kelly Warner. Small businesses lost billions of dollars to scammers last year, according to the FBI, and email scams are the costliest of all cyber crimes. One Eugene business owner who was targeted says banking with a community bank made all the difference. For Kelly Reed, paying the bills is a regular part of running his towing business, but he recently fell victim to an email request he thought was from a familiar vendor. The scammers, they basically made it appear as though if we were to take the current amount owed, and paid it over ACH, they'd give us a 10% discount. Kelly emailed the vendor directly and verified that the offer was legit, so he sent the large payment electronically. What he didn't know was... They had already scammed the vendor's emails, so it appeared as we were communicating back with that particular vendor, but we weren't. Kelly was able to quickly reach his banking team at Oregon Pacific Bank, who say scammers target local businesses daily. Stop and think about how you've received a request. Were you expecting it? If you get something via email and it's asking you to click on an attachment or to hurry up and make a decision via email, it's time to slow down. Pick up the phone and call them. Don't, don't use the phone number that's provided on the email itself to call them back. You want to call the phone that you have on record to verify. Flag any payment requests that suddenly change where or how the money is being sent. Consider additional security procedures, including two-step verification. Monitor your accounts daily, and if you suspect fraud, contact your bank. Kelly's bankers immediately contacted the receiving bank and arranged for a reverse ACH transaction, pulling the money back to his business account. A huge relief, and a reminder to Kelly how important his relationship is with his local bank. It's just invaluable. They want to help you and are there to help you. Learn more about protecting your business against fraud at bankonopb.com. I'm Kelly Warner.